and guys, welcome back to my channel. First of all, kung bago pa kayo sa channel na ito, don't forget to hit the like, click the notification bell, and subscribe nyo na din para updated kayo sa next video natin. Ngayon, uh, check muna natin kung ano nang nangyayari doon sa ating niluluto. Siyempre, nagluluto tayo guys. Ngayon, check natin. Ito na. Uy, wow. Ang sarap guys. Ang sarap. Sana all masarap ang luto. Ano naman naging masarap to, di ba? Siyempre, masarap to kasi ganyan. Ang gagawin natin, ganyan. Ayan. Para mas lalong sumarap, sarap. Ayan, di ba? Ayan. Ayan, di ba? Uh -huh. So rough. Tapos, ano pa? Ayan. Ah, ngayon. Siyempre, dagdagan natin ng tubig, guys, para... Ayan, pasensya na kayo. Ayan, diba? Dagdagan natin ng tubig para mas lalong sumarap sa rock. Tapos, ayan. Tapos, pakuluin natin. Ayan. Pakuluin muna natin. Then, next ay, yung next. Uh, Mag-ano tayo guys sa uh, ito. Ito lagay natin dito. Ayan. Ngayon, siyempre, kuha tayo ng bowl. Tapos, ito. Then, ganito ang gagawin natin guys. Ayan. Oh, di ba? Ang sarap ito. Ayan. Pa. Ayan. Ayan. Sarap. Ayan guys. So, ito muna. Ayan. Tapos guys. Andalit. Tapos guys, yung mga niluluto natin, ayan. Siyempre maglagay tayo ng kunting asin guys. Ayan, asin. Ayan, medyo masarap yung asin na yun, di ba? Ah, saan natin ilalagay? Sandali lang guys ha, kasi medyo ano, hindi natin alam. Mayroon guys, wala tayong selfie stick. Ayan, gagawin natin. Ayan. Yes. Ayan. Tapos. <laughs> Ayan. Then, ganyan natin doon. Yes. Ayan. Tapos, nakikita niyo kung Ayan, ito ang tinatawag na So yan guys, no? Yan na ba yan? Ngayon, na uh, <coughs> Meron tayong dapat hindi mawala, guys. Itong kape. <laughs> kape na naman. Tagal itong maubos, ha? Oh. Yan. Tapos. Pagod na ba kayo guys na makinig sa akin ng mga ganito? The experience pa rin tayo guide by Richard and Henry Blackaby. Yeah, the 365 daily devotions and this is day by day with God. <clears throat> Ngayon, yung topic natin ay makikita siya sa the lessons from Psalms. Yeah. So, nako guys. Sabi yung topic natin ngayon, it's all about David's priority list. David's priority list. But I 
by your great mercy, will come into your house. In reverence will I bow down toward your holy temple. Lead me, O Lord, in your righteousness because of my enemies. Make straight your way before me. Psalms 5, 7 to 8. What does it take to have a close walk with God? The right priorities. David knew God better than most people. Let's take a look at his priority list. First is to worship. David was a king, but he considered in it his highest calling to honor God. David didn't merely go to the temple as a matter of ritual. He considered it a great privilege to be invited into the presence of holy God to worship him. David's psalms of praise bear testimony to the high priority he placed on praising God. To confess his sins, that's the second priority. First is to worship God and the second is to confess his sins. David wasn't perfect. In fact, he committed some pretty major sins, including adultery and murder. However, he acknowledged his sins and humbly confessed them to God. He couldn't bear to be separated from God by his own sinfulness. So David made confession a priority as well. Third is to follow God's guidance. David was a bright man, a gifted leader, and an accomplished warrior, yet he consistently turned to God for guidance. He understood that life is too complicated for even a smartest person to figure out on his own. So he gave God's plans precedence over his own. Yeah. <clears throat> Next is to seek God's protection. God had plenty of enemies and plenty of fear. I mean David, not God. Yeah. Let me repeat, David had plenty of enemies and plenty of fear to fear. He prayed daily for God's protection and he relied on God for peace in spite of his tumultuous life. In answer to David's prayer, God guided him through many intensely dangerous situations. Next priority list of David is to thank God. David's life was characterized by thankfulness. He recognized God as the source of every blessing in his life. And he developed a habit of thanking God regularly. The book of Psalms is a record of David's grateful heart. When you lay it out, it's not hard to see why David grew so close to God. Look at the things he valued the most. Worship, forgiveness, wisdom, guidance, and gratitude. Do you want to know God better? Take David's priority list and make it yours as well. Ayan guys, kung gusto nyo na ano, na mas malaman pa ang Panginoon. Do you want, if you want to go know God better, take David's priority list and make it your as well. So David's priority list is what? Worship, forgiveness, wisdom, guidance, and gratitude. That's all. And have a blessed day. Kung first time yung napanood ang video ito, don't forget to hit the like.
click the notification bell and subscribe you na din para updated kayo sa next video natin. And that's all and have a blessed day ahead.